Hey guys, it's Nabil from Topaz, hope you're doing well. Welcome back to the channel. And I've got a very exciting video for you today. And it's of the car behind me, the most, I one of the most, I think is for me, the most iconic hypercar. It's the McLaren F1, and it's right here behind me. But first, I want to make it an apology, really, because in the last video um, that I was talking about, the Bugatti Veyron that was here for the Topaz skin, where we changed the blue, the white to blue, and we put the French flag in the back, I also did say that the owner was going to be giving us his MC12. Uh, again, he saw the car, he loved it so much, he's like, put the MC12 to the side for one minute, I want you to work on the big dog. And that's that one here behind me, is the F1. So then we're now going to, car's here, fast forward some time, the car's there, right here, and it's ready to get started working on. And I'm just looking forward to seeing the whole process and what's going to happen. Uh, it's so cool because this actual car, the owner took the car, drove it to Spa to compete in a race, a GT3 race with his Ferrari, won the race and drove this car back. I mean, that's what you call heroic, right? And the customer uses this car. I mean, this car is nearly 30, I mean, it's coming up to 30 years old. Um, you know, as you guys, I'm sure you all know what this car is. 600 plus horsepower, 627 or something. It's got 240 miles miles uh, in terms of the, the fastest speed it's one of the fastest cars up to now let alone what it was like 30 years ago um and yeah it's just one of those cars that every time it praises any workshop or goes into any workshop it's just a phenomenal thing it's, it's an event getting this car in so because the car's obviously been driven all the way to spa and back it came to us quite dirty and i think it's the right thing to do to make sure that the paint work and everything is all perfect and we're going to be jumping in straight into the wash bay and showing you that process. I'm sure you're going to be looking forward to that. Now, we are going to be doing Topaz skin as well, but I'm not going to tell you what that is and what we're going to be doing to it until later on. And uh, yeah, you're just going to have to keep your eyes peeled and, and see what's going on with this. But anyway, I'm going to leave you to it. I'll catch up with you at the end.
there you have it guys that was the video of us washing the car the car came to us as i said it had bugs on it bug splatter it had contaminants it had brake dust on the wheels that were baked on that kind of thing so we wanted to make sure it's absolutely clean before it came upstairs so we can start doing the treatments on it now one thing it's upstairs here around it's about to get treated in terms of the topaz skin i wanted to show you something quite cool on the car which as you can see here the rear engine cover has been removed and have a look at this engine it's honestly i mean a work of art if you see all the gold leaf everywhere that's literally all the way around this is pure gold leaf and it's phenomenal because they used to use that and they still use it till today for heat deflection and it's phenomenal to see that this is just everywhere everywhere it's got the gold leaf on it so anyway that's unfortunately all we have time for for this week where next week we're going to be showing you more about this Dita car going through all the details etc and we're also going to be running a competition where you're going to be able to win something now the prize will let you know what that is next week I'm also going to be introducing you to two new co-presenters uh, which are going to be helping me with this channel uh, when I'm not available to show you some of the cars because I mean we have so much content in this business and it's just not fair for you guys to not get to see more and more of it and give you a different perspective as well. That's all we have time for. I hope you liked that video. Uh, make sure to like, share, and subscribe as always. Very, very special time getting this car in uh, for me, and I hope that you guys enjoy it. So, I'll catch up with you on the next one.